What is up you guys? My refrigerator just started running so that's probably gonna be a noise you can hear from this mic, so that's great. Welcome to Totally Trendy. Hello, hi, how are you? If this is your first time here, welcome. I'm Samantha, how's it going? If you're returning, hi, good to see you again. That felt cheesy, but that's just the mood we're in. It's the end of the day and I am about to make a giant DIY stuffed teddy bear. Why am I doing it? Because stuffed animals are Fun. Who doesn't love stuffed animals? And who doesn't love giant things? Like, it's great. When I first thought about this, I was like, wow, that would be a lot of fabric. Like, how could I ever do that? And then Paul actually gave me the idea of using bed sheets. I have these different size fitted bed sheets that I'm going to stuff and use as the belly, the arms, the legs, the head, and I got a ton of stuffing. So that's really all there is to set this up. It's gonna be really fun. I'm going to make a giant teddy bear and then I'm going to surprise some of my coworkers with it. Surprise slash prank, we'll see how it goes, but let's have fun. We have run into a bit of a predicament because I'm trying to do this in secret or as secret as possible because I want to surprise people with it. But this is not very discreet. So there's an old office in Haifa Studios. This old office does not get used anymore. And I got permission to use it. So this is where I'm going to be building this bear. I am so out of breath. <gasps> Okay, it's time. I'm gonna start off with filling the twin fitted sheets that are gonna be the arms, the legs. Yeah, just the arms and the legs. Quick shout out to Paul because he filmed a giant bear video and gave me all of the leftover stuffing. So just for like a frame of reference, all of this is all the stuffing in one of those giant bears that you see from like Costco. And I have four bags, so let's see how big this bear is gonna be. I think what I'm gonna do is go ahead and glue an edge so I have something to like fill. I'm just gonna take these sections and hot glue them all together. It won't be a permanent seal most likely. I mean, who knows if we're lucky, it will be. I will probably end up doing a combination of hot glue and staples. Fitted sheets was such a good idea. It just makes it a lot easier to stuff and fill. Once I have this essentially glued all the way is when I'm really gonna start stuffing it. All right, now it is time to stuff it. Will this be a little time consuming? Yes. Do I think it'll be worth it? I hope so. This is just like Build-A-Bear on a whole nother level. I feel like he's probably gonna have some excess fabric and that's okay. Just because this is a ton of stuffing, but is it a twin size mattress? Probably not. And down it goes. This makes me wish I had one of those like Build-A-Bear fluff machines. It just like shoots fluff. That's already a substantial amount of fluff. Like, wow. And there's still so much left in this bag. I want a majority of the fluff to be in like the head and the stomach. So I'm not gonna worry too much about making these arms that big. The arms and the legs can be just like stubby little legs. It's okay. This is really working out pretty well. And with the excess fabric that I have, I can just pull it tight and then hot glue it to the seam. This is big. I'm trying to decide how large to make the legs. Like, I feel like that's a really large bear leg. I love that it like just looks like a sack of laundry. I don't know about you, but I feel like that's a great bear leg. Just like a big fluffy teddy bear. And it's like soft too. I'm just gonna take this excess edge and I'm gonna tie it in a knot. And then I'm actually going to open a part that I hot glued a little bit and tuck the knot inside. And then I'm gonna hot glue that closed. I'm just gonna put a lot of hot glue. You gotta glue what you gotta glue. <laughs> that was <laughs> The next day. It is day two now of the giant teddy bear building process. I am about to go over to my little secret space in Red Base. It's raining outside. That's just unfortunate. I only made the legs yesterday. It was the end of the day, okay. But now we are going to go complete it and then hopefully scare some people and get their reactions. So let's go. And we are back. Now that I've done the legs, I'm gonna do the arms. And I'm gonna make the arms bigger than the legs, longer, I would say. And then after that, all that's left is the head, the stomach, the ears, decorating. Okay, so there's a lot left after that. All right, I have both of the arms completely glued up and it is now time to fill them. Oh my goodness, okay. This is so much fluff. 
I feel like that's a good size arm. It's just a little bit longer than the leg. And then we'll grab the other one and do the exact same thing. I now have two arms, two legs over there, and it is time to work on the larger piece, the belly and the head. So unfortunately, I kind of made a mistake and got a flat sheet instead of a fitted one like these, but I'm still just gonna do the same thing where I like hot glue the edges together. I now have this full sheet connected. I just sealed the bottom and the side, and now I'm just gonna stuff it using all of the stuffing. So let's see how long that takes. Two hours later. Guys, it looks actually pretty good so far. I still have to do the head. It's way bigger than I thought it was gonna be. I mean, I knew I wanted it to be giant, but like, that's a big teddy bear. I think I'm gonna switch the arms and legs. I feel like the legs should probably be longer, so I'll probably switch those. But it's like comfy too. Like I want to cuddle with it. I can't wait to show everyone this. It is time to stuff this. I'm gonna cut it about here. I feel like that would be a good size head for that. And then I'm just gonna stuff that. And with the excess stuffing, I'm gonna make the little ears and like a nose. It'll be cute. I'm also realizing that I have to attach these in some way, shape, or form. I don't know why I'm like just now kind of thinking about that. Hmm, we'll see what happens. Right now though, I'm trying to figure out the best way to seal this. I I really want to get a bunch of safety pins. I need to go find some. So let's go try and find safety pins, string, anything we can really think of that can like fasten. Hey, Pat. Mm -hmm. Do you have any zip ties? I do. Oh, look at that. Look who it is. Can I have them? Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, oh my goodness. Yeah. Do you know Totally Trinity was filmed with a live studio? <laughs> <laughs> Just yeah. sitting here, back here watching. I'm gonna use these zip ties to try and put this together. Where did I put scissors? First, I'm gonna do these together. This might rip the fabric some, so I'm gonna put the hole like a little farther out. Put a tiny little hole there. And now we do the zip tie thing. This is a lot of cutting and a lot of zip tying. Before I get into like the decoration stuff and like making the ears and all that stuff, I'm gonna attach all these pieces together. I just did three zip ties. I'm gonna test it. I was trying to decide whether to give him a mouth or not, but I think I like him like this. I'm gonna look up some, I don't know, just like cartoon eyes maybe. Oh, that's a cute nose. I'm gonna curve it and then kind of come in like that. Yeah, that's cute. It's time for you to see him like in full effect. Well guys, there he is. I need to get this to the other base. I've recruited some help because I need help carrying this thing over to Blue Base. And I also need someone to vlog it. So I brought in the best vlogger I know. That's yes. <laughs> Sam doing stuff in that little area. Who knows what she's doing? What is she doing? She's laughing at herself again. That's normal for Sam. Oh, what is that monster? <laughs> what did you create in there? A teddy bear. Oh. It's so squishy and comfy. It's zip tied. Yeah. Where are we taking this thing? Blue base. Oh gosh. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> Yeah. That was the most gentle fall down the stairs I've ever seen. <laughs> he looks mangled. Don't look at his armpit. Ew. Hot I oil. looked. It's Catherine. Hey, what's up? Oh, oh there it is. Sam. What? Are you in it or are you just, <laughs> did you just fall behind her? I meant to like kind of throw it at her, but then I fell. But luckily I landed on it. I can't get off. I have no way. Hey, what's up? Hey. The floor's hey. dirty, Sam. You should get up. Yeah, I should. No and uh, PDA isn't really allowed in the office. <laughs> Gosh, I don't like the backs of his legs. Oh, yeah. I need to get him to blue base. But now that I'm thinking about like walking through the rain. That's Should okay, I have an umbrella. On this couch? Yeah. I don't see why not. He's so, so heavy. Oh, this is so comfortable. Isn't it? Holy moly. Oh, I just heard a rip. Sam, you need to do something with his eyes. Why? They're dead. You need to put eyes on him. <laughs> Look at that. That's such a big bear. I Look at how big this right. bear is. Yeah. It's and, you're, a big bear. and you're lengthy too, so. Yeah, I know. I'm 5'9". Sure it shows proportion. Oh my goodness. Can I have it? You can have it. Okay, then I love it. Yeah, I'm glad you like it's it. A gigantic fluffy pillow. That's kind of, it is, that's what it is. I mean, yeah, essentially. Do it, Sam. Full send. Just jump. Do it. How did, How is it you do it? You go. Yeah. 
Yeah. Oh. Isn't it great? This is great. I'm so happy I Dude, did this. Yeah. Who's coming down the stairs? Hey, that's so cool. What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> Make that? DIY giant teddy bear. What's his name? We haven't named it. It's Teddy. Henry. That's simple. Henry. That's Henry. a good one. Henry the teddy bear. Do you Ryan. want? Do you want to? Do it. Ready? Yeah. Go. Oh my god. Oh. That is so comfortable. Isn't it? Good night. He's like cuddling you. Okay, well, bye, Connor. <laughs> Jump off the roof and on him. It's gonna be a no for me. Well, giant teddy bear is gonna stay here in red base. Henry the giant teddy bear. I mean, look at him. This is new? Huh? What are you talking about? This has always been here. You don't remember Henry the giant teddy bear? I guess I just never noticed it. Yeah. Do you make this? Yeah, I did. When? Today. Do you make this all today, really? I made the legs yesterday. Give him a good cuddle. No. Just give him a good squeeze. It's comfortable. Yeah, it's good. Okay, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know I did, because now I have a gigantic teddy bear at the end of it. So be sure to like, subscribe, all that good YouTube things, and I will see you later. Bye.